Hey, have you ever wondered how to make your Mac even more efficient with a simple trick? My name's Chris, and today I'm going to share with you the magic of setting up hot corners on your Mac. This simple yet powerful feature has transformed how I work and even added an extra layer of security to my computer data. There was this one time I had to rush away from my desk, leaving my sensitive information displayed on my screen, and thanks to hot corners, locking my screen was instant and seamless, saving me from potential data breaches or those prying eyes. But now I can step away with my Mac with peace of mind, knowing that all my information is secure. But that's just scratching the surface of what hot corners can do to enhance your productivity on a Mac. Stick around as we dive deep into the setting up this feature, and by the end of this video, I promise you your Mac workflow will never be the same. And if you're passionate about productivity hacks like I am, drop a comment below with your favorite trick that helps you stay efficient. Without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so to get to your hot corners, what we need to do is we need to go into our system settings or system preferences if you're on an older version. So I'm gonna go here. And then we need to find the desktop and dock section. And we gotta scroll all the way down to the bottom. And this is where the hot corners are hiding. Now, when we open it up, you can see, this is how I have my hot corners set up. For most folks, especially those that have newer Macs, you're probably gonna look something a little along the lines of this, where it's just a quick note in the bottom right hand corner. Quick note uses the Apple Notes app and allows you to make a quick note. Now to set a hot corner, you simply click on one of these dropdowns. And for me, the bottom right hand corner, I like to be application windows. In the top right hand corner, I like to be mission control. The bottom left hand corner, I actually like to use Launchpad but I don't like to use Launchpad just as it is. I like to make myself hold the Command key down when I do it, and they call this a modifier key. So Command, Shift, Option, all, all modifier keys for you. And what that means is that I have to actually hold that key down while I perform that action in that hot corner. If you notice on my machine, the left-hand side of the dock, I tend to go into the corners a lot when I'm working with the dock because I just get a little aggressive. And so I'll accidentally lock my screen or launch launch pad if I don't have the modifier key set up. So you can see when I click on it here, there's no keys. It just works as is. But if I hold the command key down, now it's showing me that if I hold command and go down to the corner, it'll do launch pad. Whereas if I'm not holding the key, it just doesn't work. And I like to do the same thing with my lock screen. So my lock screen is great because it takes me, it's kind of like logging out and it takes me back to the login screen. All my applications and stuff are still open, so it loads right up really quick, but it kind of keeps my computer a little more secure where I can only get back in either with Touch ID, my password, or my Apple Watch. So this is how I personally like it. Now, I love Mission Control in the top right because Mission Control, I usually have a lot of full page um, applications open or working with multiple desktops. And so if I go up to the top right hand corner, now you can see I have desktop one, desktop two, and all these other things that I'm doing in full screen. So if I click and come to desktop two, this is a great way for me to be able to demonstrate applications. So application windows, so if I go back to my desktop and I go back to hot corners, the application windows are for a specific application that you're in, not all of your applications. So if I come back to mission control and I come here, and now if I go to the bottom left-hand corner, it allows me to see all my open windows for Google Chrome in this particular case, because that's now the active open application. So imagine maybe you are working with multiple PDFs or you're working with multiple Word documents. This is a great way for you to be able to basically pull them up on your desktop, lay them all out in front of you, and quickly go and access the one that you want and bring it to the front. And it's just as simple as going to that bottom right hand corner and then clicking. So put this wherever you like, but this is how I use my hot corners. It increases my productivity, lets me fly around my machine quickly and get to what I need to without having to worry about it. And that's it. It's the easiest way to set it up and increase your productivity all in one. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe and we'll see you soon.